Hello everyone, my name is Grace and welcome to my first 2021 CW Plus video. If you've not seen one of my videos before, I am a drama therapist for CW Plus and my videos contain movement, stories, um, mindfulness, kind of all sorts of things like that to help us with our well-being during these challenging times. And I just want to take a moment to say that the start of 2021 has been difficult um, for many people. With the national lockdown coming on us again and schools being shut, I think it's been a really hard time for so many. So I really hope that you take this video to just allow yourself to be, allow yourself to look after your own mental health and well-being and just take these next 30 minutes, which is how long this video and this session is going to be, to really be there for yourself. In these 30 minutes, no one is going to need anything from you and you don't need to think about anyone else but yourself. With that being said, we are coming into a new year and although it's been a challenging one, I hope and I think everyone hopes that it's going to improve and get better. And although I don't want to necessarily myself set any New Year's resolutions this year because I think sometimes that can put a lot of pressure for, on us, I do think it's good to maybe set some intentions. So some simple um, intentions on how you want to be this year, how you want to live, and not necessarily any goals, but things that you want to live by. For example, one of mine is I want to remain more in the present this year, because I think it's very easy to think about the past or think about the future. So one of my intentions is to remain in the present as much as possible in 2021. So that is just a very quick uh, introduction on what we're going to do in this session and in this video. We're going to be setting some intentions for 2021 and we are going to be really being mindful about our intentions, about what we want, and we might also do a little bit of movement as well. But as ever in my videos, take them at your, own at your own pace. If there are parts of your body you can't move, whether you have an injury or whether that's because you're in a compromising position today, that is not a problem at all. Just take everything I say as a suggestion. And if there's things that you can't do, just Focus on your body and notice how your body feels and what your body needs and fulfil those needs as much as you can and in any way you would like to. For this video you will need some pens, felt tips, colouring pencils. We're not necessarily going to draw in this session but we are going to write. So a simple biro would be fine and some paper. If you don't have those with you right now, that's not a problem. When I put some music on later on in the video, there will be a chance for everyone who doesn't have any with them at the moment to go and get some. But for now, I would like us to start with our check-in. And now, if you've not done one of my videos before, this is how I start every single session. We check in with ourselves and with each other. So we think about how we're feeling today. So we're going to take a deep breath in together and out. And we're going to do one more. And as we breathe in and out one more time, Really focus on your mind and on your body 
and think of a word for how you're feeling today. More than one word may have come to mind. So just think about the general feeling of your mind and body today. In your head, you don't need to say it out loud just yet. And we are going to take one more deep breath in and out. And after we've breathed out, we are going to do a sound and a movement that represents how we're feeling today. So I'm going to demonstrate and then you can go after me. So once more breathing in and out. Oh. Oh. So that is my sound and movement for today. I hope you were watching that. Obviously, my sound and movement today shows that I'm tired, I'm fatigued, I'm feeling maybe a little bit rusty after having a couple of weeks off for Christmas. So we are going to breathe in and out one more time together. And after we breathe out, we're all going to do our sound and movements together. So breathing in and out. So a sound and movement for how you're feeling. <sighs> Thank you everyone. I'm going to put some music on now and we are just going to warm up our bodies in any way we feel is right for us today. So as I said at the beginning of this video, um, take the video at your own pace and the movements at your own pace and just simply allow your body to kind of breathe through the movements and stretch any parts of your body that need it, pay attention to those parts of your body that need that attention today. Um, and if you don't have any pens or paper with you, now is your chance to go and get some. And then when you come back, you can simply join in with the warm up when you're ready. So I'm just going to put some music on and then we will start the warm up. If you need to turn down the volume of your device, you can do that if the music's slightly too loud for you, but I'll keep it at around this level while we warm up. Just doing anything that you want to, you don't need to copy me. Any stretches that you need to do, any movement that you feel that you need to do today.
start to slowly bring that down to stillness. Start to breathe through the work, the warm up, and bring your movements down to slow and still movements. Don't forget to breathe. just do any last warm-up movements if you need to, any last stretches to finish off what you've been doing. And when you're ready, coming down to the seated position or standing or lying down, whatever's most comfortable for you, so that we can write our 2021 intention. Thank you everyone. So hopefully you all feel slightly more warmed up or slightly more supple from the stretching. If you feel like you need more of a warm up today, if you're feeling really tense or you were enjoying that and so you feel like you need some more, that's absolutely fine. What you can do is rewind the video and continue warming up as much as you like. And then just come back to this moment to continue on with the rest of the session. So now it is time for us to write our 2021 intention. So like I said at the beginning of this video, one of mine, an example that I can give, is to be more present this year. So not thinking about the future, not thinking about the past, but really enjoying the present moment and what it brings me and how it makes me feel. Enjoying the sounds around me, enjoying the sunlight through the window and really being in the present. You can steal that one off me if that one sounds like something you would like to do. But ultimately we are now going to write down three intentions for 2021. These don't have to be goals because I know that this year has started off very differently with the national lockdown. So if you feel like setting goals at the moment is something that you really don't feel aligned with, which is how I feel, then that is fine. However, if you would like to set some goals, then by all means, so whatever you feel like today, you would like to set some goals or some intentions. And we are going to write down three. I'll put some music on whilst we're doing this. And let's say we'll have about five minutes to write down three goals or intentions. If you need longer, again, you can rewind the video or pause the video. So I'm just going to set some music on. And if you could just take out your paper and your pens and start to write down your three goals or intentions. And as I said before, we are going to have about five minutes to do this.
We have about one minute left, or maybe just over one minute of our five minutes. We have about 15 seconds left on this song, so I'm just going to allow this song to play out and then we can share our intentions with each other. So our time is up. If you need more time, please pause or rewind the video and continue to write. So I will start by sharing my intentions and then you can share yours with someone you're with or if you're by yourself, you can simply read them and tell yourself in your mind why they're important to you. So my first one, which I already uh, told you was to remain in the present. My second one is to do something every day which helps my mental health and in the sentence I have underlined the word something because even if it's just getting up and going for a 10 minute walk that does usually help with my mental health when I'm feeling a little bit sad, that does give me a pick up. So even if it's something really small, it still helps. So I'm making the choice to get up and help myself in some way. And then my third and final one is to laugh and let go. Because sometimes I think life can get really serious and although there are really difficult times which we all face I think sometimes I forget to laugh and to let go in times that are happy 
because life does feel a bit serious at the moment. So those are my three intentions. Now take a moment to remind yourself of yours and think about why you have chosen them. And you can share them with someone who you're with if you are with any, anyone. And now what we are going to do is look at every intention, each one, or maybe it's a goal. And we are just from where we are now, whether you're sat, stood, lying down, we are going to put a gesture to that intention. So for example, for my first one, to remain in the present, it's simply going to be as I'm simply being. My second one, to do something every day which helps my mental health, I might do the gesture of <sighs> to show that I want my mind to be clearer this year. And for laughing and letting go, my gesture might be <sighs> for example. You might feel a bit silly doing this, but Sometimes being silly helps our well-being as well. So think about what gestures and sound you can put to your 2021 intentions. And I'm going to play a piece of music and we are going to just perform our gestures to ourselves or to whoever we're with. You can just take this time to go through each of them. We'll only be doing this for a couple of minutes. And just play out your gestures in your sounds and in your movement. See if they develop and then we can come back to stillness. So you can develop these movements in any way you like. Just think of those intentions as you're moving to help you about 20 seconds left. Really think about your intentions now for the last couple of seconds. Keep them in your mind really strongly as we come down to stillness. Thank you everyone, let's all take a deep breath in and out together. We only have three minutes left of our video and our session. 
So I'd like us to come back to the room that we're in, to the space that we're in. If you need slightly longer to work on your intentions as movements, by all means, rewind the video. But for us that are in real time, we have to end soon. So take a look around your room, familiarise yourself with the space that you're in. And I would like you to count the number of things you can see that are the colour green. I can see 10 in my space. Maybe you can see more, maybe you can see less. Next, the colour red. Hmm, I think I can see, in, oh, 12, 12. And what I'm wearing, 13. Maybe you can see more, maybe you can see less. Okay, and last but not least, let's do the colour blue. I have quite a lot. I think I would say maybe about 25 for me. So many, many, many blue objects. So count your blue things and then we are going to end the session. Thank you very much for joining me today. Um, I hope that this helped in some way and I will continue to be putting out videos every two weeks um, and I hope that 2021 brings you health and happiness and I will see you in my next video.